Hey guys, what's up? I hope everyone's good. Um, oh my gosh. So I just put on a light, light concealer. So I hope everyone's been doing well. Um, I know it's been a while. Sorry, the sun. It has been a while. Um, there has been, you know, some changes, good changes for me. Um, yeah, girl, she just got, you know, her, her license, so, you know, I'm so happy about that, so, Miss Independent, you guys already know, so, just want to say what's up to my queens and my kings, um, hope everyone's good, you know, keeping safe, yeah, um, so the last time I had uploaded a YouTube vlog, that was like of last year, so I know y'all been waiting. Some of y'all been hitting me up like, girl, you know, when are you gonna do, you know, makeup vlogs, when are you gonna do like your, your YouTube trends or fashion trends, so. Sorry, your girl has been busy, so, you know, sorry about that, but definitely I'm just gonna try to work more on my YouTube vlogs and so on. Um, I had mentioned in my last vlog that, you know, I've been working on some things. So just look out for, you know, future like surprises. So you guys would see by then. So, and um, also for those that still, you know, check out the Ipsy website, like my monthly, the monthly glam bags. Um, you guys definitely check out ipsy.com. Um, they do have some nice products. Um, just to update you guys, you know, um, you go on their website and you take a, you take like a makeup test like a skin test and you get like five products um five samples from new companies it could be like different um, makeup companies new more newer brands and um like brand name brands so but most of their products are more new you may probably never heard of them but it's a nice company and for me, um, the last time I ordered from them, that was like last year, but it's not that I'm not with, um, I don't order from them anymore, but um, my skin, my skin is very sensitive and um, I do order like one or two of their products. I'm more like their concealers, um, their like eyeshadow. Like I got this nice one. I will show you guys today cause I'm gonna do a quick makeup tutorial for you guys. Um, so those are the main things that I like from them. I like their um, concealers and their eyeshadow and also um, their lipsticks. So they do have some newer products that you may have never heard of, but you know, it's good to try new things, like if you're into trying new things. So especially like makeup, makeup brands. Sorry guys, don't know what my hair is doing. I'm gonna put it at the back. So. Okay, so let's start with um so far i've already put on a light makeup <sighs> great um one sec guys hold on I can't believe I forgot my makeup. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna do a quick makeup tutorial. Um, so far I 
have like on a light makeup I had some errands to run so I was you know pretty busy today but when as you guys already know like if I'm running errands I don't put on like heavy makeup I just do a light makeup um, with my favorite concealers I usually like using um, the NYX brand that's a good concealer that I like using oh my gosh my hair this is a great concealer I like using um, and it's golden honey so that's it right there this one is all done usually when it comes to my concealers I go pretty heavy and um, for me this is my number one brand that I like and especially if you already have like good skin and you don't need to put on a lot of makeup if I'm just running in and out I just put on concealer and just that's it sometimes so almost the the time I would just mix it with my makeup which is the Maybelline fit me you already know oh my gosh it's so sunny <laughs> you guys already know and it's 330 toffee caramel so that's my um that's my fit that fits my um my skin my skin type so so i already like i said have a light makeup on now the other makeup um the other concealer that i'm into now is the elf brand this is a good brand and i like this one because it's a medium beige so when it comes to my concealers i usually like going i like going lighter um because i'm more with my chest my chest is light so that's how i match my um my makeup for my face so so i start with and I like matching my makeup with my outfits. So if I'm wearing a pink or a red, I'll just match it with, you know, the color and my outfit. So, oh my gosh, the sun is a lot. So. so I usually start off here. Sorry, guys. The spot I'm in is giving me... <laughs> It's a lot, so, okay, there we go, all right, so, let me, So what I'm going to start off with first is my concealer and I just dab it here. I dab it around here, around the eyes and I just dab it in the spots that especially wherever I have like little blemishes or as we older women all the queens would say like our age spots but who can tell so so those are my main areas where I have like spots you can barely see it but for me I just covered them up quickly and you just put some here I'm not into the whole contouring like a lot of 
you know, I'm not a makeup artist, but I do love makeup, plain up with makeup. I don't like doing a whole bunch of contouring. I think that's, you know, leave that to the professional, but as long as it looks good for you, then, you know, girl, you do you. So, so that's that. And what I do is I just let it sit for a while until it gets dry. Um, what I usually do first, I put on, I put on like either a sunscreen or a primer at the bottom. Someone had bought me this and I haven't even used it, so. Maybe I should use it now. I don't want my hair to get, cause my hair is in my way. <laughs> okay. It's just to keep back my hair, guys. Okay. So let me just get this. What's going on? It's just to keep down my hair. Um, so while I'm done to try, I'll just let that sit. And as I'm done to try, I'll just use my brush. You guys already know I'm not really into brush brushes like to you know spread out the makeup. I usually like using sponge because I find with the sponge you could get a lot of work done. So okay. So for me, let me start with my sponge. And when I do my makeup, I just do it really quick. It's already done. So, so I have that all. So I just pat it down. And then I'll pat that one too. And I'm just gonna go over with my um, makeup. So I would just mix the makeup and the concealer together. So. I wasn't gonna do this video cause I have a damn cold sore on my lips. So, and those that get cold sores, it's just embarrassing cause it's like, I'm glad at work I still wear my mask because I'm like, you know, just cover that up. So, but once I leave it alone, it leaves me alone. So, pretty much. So, as that is drying, I'm just going to mix my makeup with the concealer. I just even it out so and I'm also gonna mix it with the concealer on top so I could do my makeup in my sleep it's like I don't like no fuss don't like 
doing the most when it comes to contouring and all of that. So. The only time I would spend a lot, a long time on my makeup is like if I have somewhere really important to go. Then I would be probably go a little heavy in the concealer. And ladies, you know, do your neck because it's good to match um, the makeup with the, um, your makeup with your neck so it could match together. So, And it's always good to um, moisturize your neck and your face. Always good to moisturize your hands, your neck, your chest, because you already know. That's how people could tell your age, okay? <laughs> so that's that. It's done. Um, that's that. Now, when it comes to my eyebrows, Usually, I don't make a fuss. Um, I use a mascara brush. I have a mascara. And um, I just go about, you know, and brush it out. So I do that, brush it out, make sure it's even. And this mascara is done, so usually I don't like using mascara. Um, unless if I have like an important event to go to, then I just go about quickly so so what I do is as I brush out the my eyebrows I go over it with a eyeliner pen I know a lot of people's like okay girl why would you do that but I my um brow pencil is finished so this is what I do when I don't have my um my brow pencil. So let me so I just go over that. I don't go heavy, I just go over it light so it could look natural. So that's that. Um, now when it comes to this part, I just give it a little brush with my, um, with my brush, my makeup brush. Now what I do is, I swear the sun, I'm trying to get away from the sun. What I do is I go over under my brow with my concealer just to, you know, have a nice, um, just to have a nice, like, color tone, um, base underneath the brow so I don't put it heavy so okay. don't want to put it too heavy but and I like my makeup to look natural that's why I don't do the most okay 
so I just went underneath the eye with my concealer. Guys, you guys already know me when it comes to concealer I go pretty heavy I would say more underneath the eyes and um, when it comes to mixing it with my makeup depending on like what event or what I got going on so I would let that try yeah can let that try For you trendy people, boy, I had some friends that went down for um, carnival, over here they call it um, can carabana, down there we call it carnival, lord, they had a good time, they had a blast, and I heard um, between Bungie Garland, Marshall Destra, between who else um patrice roberts and um patrice roberts also um nyla black that's my girl i love her and um i forgot the guy that she sang with so those are my main favorite but my number one is bungee garland so i hope I'm not sure if he won Road March, but I hope his song wins Road March. So I heard this kind of all was crazy this year. So, but yeah, okay. As it's trying, let me. So this is not even the right brush. Gosh, I don't want to be going back and forth. So what I'm gonna do now. Is I'm gonna go over my my brush to just smooth it out and just to give it that natural like you know to just emphasize underneath the brow So pretty much you could see the um you could see how it's looking and the extras I just go underneath the eye so okay so that's that that's how that's looking ladies if you need to even it out again you just go over with your sponge or you could go over your brush so but for me I prefer the sponge because you could get in so many areas better with the sponge I find so okay so that's that That's how I'm looking. Um, now, I want to match my... I'm thinking about what eyeshadow I should match my outfit with. Um, and guys, I did my nails. Before I would spend a whole lot getting my nails done, when I could just do it myself, like, 
order the nails online or you could easily go to like a drugstore and pick up um you know the press on nails so save me some dollars so lord i could do everything my makeup my nails style myself like hello okay so i'm not sure which one i should use but i really love this one this palette it's it's from ipsy.com and it's these two are more matte base these are more like on the metallic side like shimmery so for me i would probably go with this one and at the back it tells you the different names of the eyeshadows so the one i'm gonna use which is this one that color this color right here um which one is that so this one is called resilience that one there it's given me more of a orangey reddish metallic color so it would match the outfit i'm wearing so let me that's the color guys that's how it looks so i love it it's more of like an orangey burnt color i would say more like this but more on the reddish side okay so so guys i'm gonna my eyeshadow and what I like to do I like to start in the corner of the eye right here in the corner and you just even it out Usually when I'm going to work, this is how I do my makeup anyways, so, but, yeah, that's how I'm looking. I just try to even it out. Like that. So that's how it looks. And it pretty much matches the outfit I'm using that I'm wearing right now. So okay. I'm just gonna remove this because it makes me look <laughs> it's just not given okay so that's how it looks like if I'm gonna work or just gonna run you know if I have an appointment that's my makeup guys and if you want to bring it up a notch 
you want to do like an evening like go out for the evening dinner with your boo or your friends what you could do is it's like I'll just use this I'll just use that to type that. So, if I want to bring it up for up a bit for more of an evening look, give it a little more ump drama. If I'm just going casual, I would just wear my um put on a lip gloss. This one is Sophia and Mabel. more of a lip gloss okay the one my lip is dry and i know when i have to school so i shouldn't even be using like my lipsticks and stuff like that because but what i do is i would just go over and sanitize them Oh, I won't even use this after so I only use my lip gloss more in the summertime so I would get a new one anyways but but it's drying up so it's good um okay then so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use my eyeliner pencil and this one is more waterproof um the brand is Essence. You could get it at any um, shopper's drug mart, so it's pretty affordable. So that's it. And I always love to do a nice, like, cat eye. So. So I'm going to start at the end. Just continue. So that's how it's looking. You could make it take depending on it depends on you, but for me I'll just do it a bit light. And then you just continue going about. And if you're not getting it, you could always go about start over again you know just start over but that's how it's looking so that's that see it just gives it a bit of a Level it up a bit, level up the eyes, give it a bit of drama, make it pop. So I love that. And um, as I contour underneath the um, eyebrow, it just makes it pop as well. And it, um, it lets it stand out, like it brings it out more. It features more the brow and underneath the brow, like the bone under there. So that looks good. So if I'm gonna wear a lipstick, 
um, this is my favorite color. I know Riri Fenty, she came out with some nice lip gloss and stuff, so definitely I want to get my hands on them. So for now, I'm using my drugstore bought um, Essence brand, and this one is my favorite color. It's called it's more of a semi matte, and it's. The color is crazy. So. Um, this is the color of it. So um, that's the color. It's more of a rose pink color. Um, let me see. I've already used it for the week. So yeah, it's more of a rose color, but. That's how it's looking. Lord, this um, guys, I'm so sorry. That's how my makeup's looking. If you want to keep it simple, you could just wear a lip gloss. That's it. Or you could add like a lipstick. So pretty much. So let me try the lipstick. So. I love this lipstick because it's more of a soft color. So that's it. So. Hey ladies, that's it, that's how I'm looking. So usually for work, like I would usually go like this, but I won't do too much with the um, eyeliner, especially on the side, depending on the day that I'm having, like if I feel like dressing up or if I have, you know, something to do after work or go out, then I would, you know, this is more of a glam look for me. Um, and if you want to go up a notch, you could add um, the eyelashes. I'm not into eyelashes. I ain't got the time for that. It's, you know, but yeah, this, this is the end look. hope you guys like it I will be doing more um, makeup tutorial I also want to do like reviews and different like makeup brand makeup products and stuff um, I also want to try um, like the vitamin C serums especially ladies you know as we get older and we have like the different different spots whether from um sunscreen not putting enough sunscreen age spots so more i'm gonna more review like different like you know skin products so look out for that and i thank you guys for you guys patience and you know, hope you guys have a blessed day and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Okay, love you. Take care.